You have the option to export your enterprise calendar entries and import them into other calendar programs, so long as those programs support ICS files like Microsoft Outlook. You can export calendar entries from the date list on either the Calendar tab or the Query tab. From the date list, click on the entry you wish to export. It will then be highlighted in blue. Right-click on the highlighted entries and select Export to an ICS file based on the due date. Enter a file name and choose where to save this new exported file. Click Save. The exported dates will include the specific return name in addition to tax type, jurisdiction, and applicable company name. Importing is a little different. If you exported only dates on a single calendar day, then you can simply double-click on the file you exported and then click Save and Close on the window that appears. The entries will be added to your Outlook calendar. Remember that this only works for an export where all the entries are due on the same day. If you saved entries with multiple due dates, first open Outlook or your applicable calendar program, then go to File on the menu bar and select Import and Export. Click on Import an iCalendar or vCalendar file, BCS, and click Next. Navigate to the ICS file you exported from the Enterprise Calendar and double-click to open it. Or you can click the file name and click OK. All the entries will be added to your Outlook calendar. Calendar updates run independently from other modules in Enterprise. You can still use Enterprise while Calendar is updating. However, you can't use Calendar while it updates. If you attempt to close Enterprise before Calendar is finished updating, you'll get a warning message. Go back and let the updates finish before closing Enterprise. Thank you for watching this training module on Calendar in Premium Pro Enterprise. I hope it was useful for you. If you'd like further training and more tips on our software, check out our training courses online here or our YouTube channel here.